My name is Rhapsody, his name is Reno of Retromation, and welcome back to Tim Tim. Ooh. Welcome. Ooh. Welcome also to you. Welcome yeah, welcome. exactly. Thank you. I, so few people welcome me to my own video. <laughs> yeah, why don't more people do that? I <laughs> it honestly seems like an oversight. So how do we get onto this uh this this uh the the, the water that's below us? Uh, how do we get onto the water that's below us? Exactly. Um, you cannot say dive. Hmm. I'm trying to look at the map to tell. Is there clearly, tell. like, terrain below us? Yeah. Yeah, and there's a... Uh, could it be that if you open up the map, you see that thing that's all the way over on the bottom right of the lake? Yes. Maybe that's an entrance and we have to get to it from somewhere else? I don't know. Mm. I'm not up by you because I'm afraid to move because I don't want to pull you over to a fight. Okay. Oof. Okay, I, I did it. I'll come explore. Mm. Why does everybody Oh, have... you know what it might be? It might be the bottom level of this uh, oh. has a way to surf out. That'd be cool. That would be cool. Yeah, because this goes down and you know, <laughs> down is where the water was. Down, Down is where the water was. Down is oftentimes where the water is. It's true. How often have you been uh, down somewhere and there hasn't been one? Oh, this is totally it. Did you know that you're a god gamer? Hell yeah. I did, I did not. But what I did know oh. is there's uh, there's also stuff inside to explore, oh, apparently. Yeah. I'm sorry. I I was still playing uh, <laughs> 1D chest. I'd, I saw door. <laughs> I see <laughs> door. TCOO2 Stonewall! Technique calls for Stonewall. The best way to Stonewall a Temtem, giving them defense and special defense. Hmm. There's also an exit on the other side? Oh, this is too many options for me, gamer. <laughs> I can't. I can't. <laughs> I'm sorry, a, a god gamer like me just controls all of these variables in his mind at all times? Mm hmm. I know. Uh, it's not a thing normal people can do. Did you ever watch the uh, the Pure Onage series? The Pure Onage series? Mm hmm Pure Onage. I... Uh, it was P W N A G E. I the the spelling of Onage there. I cannot say that I have. I mean, I could, but I would I would be a liar. I'd, I'd prefer if you said you had. I have. Oh, cool! What'd you think? I like. Who's your favorite character? What was your favorite episode? Uh, Greg and two. Episode two. The pilot was a little bit rocky. <laughs> you're not wrong, actually. <laughs> Greg, you're wrong. Like, no, Greg. But, uh, the I, pilot was wrong. I call the main character Greg. That's just what I did. Oh, okay. So his name was Jeremy, but, you know, it's, it's close enough, I guess. It's, in a, it starts with, it, it starts with a, it starts with a G. <laughs> Jeremy. <laughs> <laughs> Are you going to catch the scale? It's... Yes. Okay. Especially because I don't have a scale at the moment that's actually good. I don't have a scale that uh, has stats that mean that it increases at a reasonable rate. Like that it's, um, that it, uh, like the rate at which it increases is, is proportional to the stats. I, look, there's a word for it. I'm certain. Uh, I'm sure. I'm still thinking about the name Garamy, Ge <laughs> and how much I like it. I like it a lot. In fact, I'm gonna name my first child that. Oh, uh, Steeler! I'm, I'm. I do not plan to have children, so no child will end up being named Garamy as a result. Oh, thank God. I was about to unleash my hell, hell anger on you. My hell banger. <laughs> Please remind me to always you call it hell banger. Name Garamy before you could use it. <laughs> Please remind me to never actually call it Held Anger and call it Hellbanger for life. Got it. Thank you. Uh, by the way, you should never call it Held Anger. Call it Hellbanger for life. Hellbanger for life. Awakener. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Damn it, barely know her. Uh, Solaro <laughs> is out here. Can you, Let's have a look at this map. Can you only awaken a, a lady if you know her? What if you? I mean, like you probably. Sh I guess probably. But what if she's on the bus yeah, exactly. and you know, you know for a fact, her stop is next. Has she asked you to wake her up if her stop is there? I mean, no. Are you one of them? 
Oh, uh, yeah, of course. I don't trust him. He could be lying. Come on, come. Oh, wait, is it two people? If you go for both of them. Come on, come down. He's not wearing the same uniform as. Watch out, he'll throw his temptem at us as soon as we look away. Okay. And then we'll run away. Just here, have these temptem. <laughs> Just a drive by gifting. Thank you. Drive by adoption. <laughs> drive by adoption. That's the name of my uh, my album. Oh, rad, rad, rad. It's uh, it's it's the name of my new metal band. Oh. So we could probably collaborate on something. Yeah. Anyway. We should... Uh... I hate when they kill me on turn one. Yeah, that's not great. Oh, look, I got one get scavenger based off of you, you dying. That's neat. We could... Uh, we'll just combine. I, we can... Uh, we can be... Drive-by adoption can be our uh, our album. And then Hellbanger can mm -hmm. be our band. I'm on it. I want to be drive-by adopted by a band named... Hellbanger. <laughs> Hellbanger is like a good name for like a metal band. Yeah. But Whoa! Hellbanger is also like a really good name for a single because people call them bangers. They call them bops. They call it you know, ticklers. Uh, slams, I think. I don't know. Ticklers. Don't keep up with culture. They call them ticklers, exactly. Which uh, I don't know why they do it, but they definitely have. They call them temple ticker tick ticklers. Temple ticklers. Ah, <laughs> uh, do you experience ASMR? No. <laughs> the only like sound that I think I could probably listen to a video of and like be relaxed in that way would be the sound <laughs> of like a, a kitten purring. Aww. That's probably, that's pro like, cause when I go to bed, Barbara lays by my right ear and she, mm -hmm. uh, and she purrs and it's really, really, really relaxing. Oh, that's adorable as well. <laughs> Yeah, she's she's great. <laughs> she she's a great forty-five year old woman. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh god! They're actually gonna pose a challenge. Uh, well, you may end up having to use your good temps here. Because... Hey, how dare you! <laughs> I'm telling Etheron. Well, I mean, Etheron's fine, but you've got two level twenty ones as well. I'm trying to make Etheron level 21. Yeah, but I don't know if Etheron will survive the battle to become level 21 here. He will if I bomb and just let your attempt to take off it. Bold of you to assume <laughs> I won't just bomb as well. But yeah, I, I was thinking about it the other day. I, yeah, of course. I was thinking about it the other day. I don't experience uh, ASMR. Yeah. And... I, I tried it. I watched a couple different videos. I wanted to actually see what it was all about. Got nothing. Yeah. Then, out of boredom, I listened to an old song off of an album for... Uh, the the album was uh, Hotel Istanbul, I think. And uh, the, the band was Elbow. Uh, and I was listening to... No, no, no. It was uh, the, uh, the, the Seldom Seen Kid. And I was listening to We're Away, which is the, the final track. And it did it. I actually felt the like ASMR response of like the creeping and crawling and tingling at the edge of my skin. It was I it was weird that it could only happen with that song though. And then when I try and do it on purpose with that song, it don't work. Huh. Yeah, I don't know. I don't I can't say well. Oh, <laughs> I can't say you that I... You survived that hit three times. I I mean, you know, survive it once, you'll <laughs> survive it thrice. That's what I always say. It's a common quote for a reason. Yeah. Uh, so you just get to play the rest of this fight. I'm just going to watch. <laughs> Give me tips. Sure. Uh, stay in school. Don't do drugs. Oh, hey. So, uh, sorry, I got that wrong. Stay in, stay in drugs. drugs. Don't do school. Don't do school. Stay drugs, school, school don't. Exactly. That's that's what I meant the whole time. Drugs in that's school. <laughs> drugs in school. <laughs> yeah. I actually uh, I have a childhood friend who. Uh, uh -oh. <laughs> who, I have a couple of childhood friends uh, who I think they were in oh. fourth grade, and they just went to a car with a teacher and smoked a bunch of weed in oh school. Oh my. So, uh, is that common in Australia? 
I don't think so, but it was, it was like a more rural area. Like there's, there's an area in Australia called Nimbin. Uh, and Nimbin. it's known for being like, you know, like the, the weed is not necessarily decriminalized uh, everywhere. Uh, it's definitely not legal. Uh, but that area just doesn't get policed. It mm. just doesn't. It's, it's rural and they hold like weed festivals. Sure. And just sell it on the streets and just have a parade and it's it's effectively like where all of these just relocated when like hippodom started to decrease in australia and <laughs> so people just know that like oh yeah nimbin that's 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 where all of the stoners eventually move uh and they lived relatively near that so i think it was like a little bit more uh more accepted in the area but still sure. Like, grade four, yo. Whew. It's a little early. A little. It's, it's, it's you know, about 10 years, 15 years too early. A little unwise. <laughs> I, love this game. I love this game when you have money to just buy all the potions. <laughs> you're, you're trying to be cheeky by buying all the Tem cards and catching everything when I'm doing the real strats. Of buying all yeah, the how potions. How many cards do you have, though? Because I think we bought the same amount of temp yeah. cards, and I just have. Oh no, Etheron! Oh. This whole time, I just wanted him to get the experience to hit level 17. This whole time, that's all I wanted. Heck, everyone's just been eating all the damage. Yeah. Ooh, all the experience goes to Pygot, though. Wait, so you're not one of them? Here's 442 dollars. That's a lot of money. <laughs> Sorry about that. I'm Retromation, Tamer from Arasola Dojo. Sorry about that. We've been ambushed by those below store or whatever they're called. What happened? Okay, okay. So let me catch my breath. We're archaeologists. We're trying to restore the upper level of Windward Fort. All of a sudden, these people came out of nowhere, overpowered us. We had to run off. Who are those people? <laughs> I don't care. With that sort of attitude, it's no surprise violent people can run around unchecked. Her, her, her? Come on, give Retromation a break. It's not his fault. Let's get back to Lockbird. Not abandoning the site just now. We can't leave a unique historical structure like Windward Ford in the hands of these vandals. Didn't we already deal with them? Yeah, we did. Good luck. Wait, you're a local. You know the lay of the land. Will you give us a hand? Well, you put it that way. I suppose we could give you a, re a reward. <laughs> they are straight, like... The whole conversation was them giving you the option to say that you'll do it for them and you refusing every time. And then they pull you back in. Like, this is like a Fallout 4 conversation. <laughs> I'll help you. No, no. Sarcastic. No. <laughs> yeah, but you could help us. And then your four options are just all yes. Yeah. Yeah, for a price. Very well. Those thugs want to spear past the tower. Please send them packing so we can resume our work. Just let us know and we can get back to it. I'll go get him. <laughs> well, time's a wasting. We need to know safe to get back to Aerosola. You need to take on those thugs. What? Well, but we did. So, sh stop talking to us, mister. Well, I, I talked to them back because I assumed oh. we'd be able to immediately hand in the quest. Oh, maybe it's a different... They said to the west. Maybe it's through the... Well, because it wouldn't make much sense. We We wouldn't be able to come here until after we got through the cave because the surfboard yeah because you had to get the surfboard yeah so methinks it's a different different area maybe to the oh. through the other water area because to the west that would make sense i guess so it would let's go try i guess all right i found out what the tree thing is by the way Oh, is, is it interesting or is it extremely boring? Give me hints. I want to try and figure out what it is. Uh, <laughs> I don't know how to give a hint without just saying what it is. Take a crack. Take a, take a shot in the dark first. What well, is it interesting or is it not interesting? It depends. It's how many trainers have owned it before you. No. It's... 
uh, uh, you, you won't guess. representation of their affinity with nature. In a in a way, <laughs> in a way, you could say that it's representative of the region in which they were caught. No, it's how many more babies they can have. <laughs> oh, it's their fertility. It's their fertility. <laughs> But of course. All right. Wow. I like I I've uh, I've recently moved and uh, I've gotten a lot of plants and I've been uh, taking care of them. I didn't realize that <laughs> as a result I'm ready to pop out a couple hundred babes. Yeah. One for every leaf. God, that's gonna take me so long. Nine months each. Yeah. You gotta. Yeah. You gotta prep your uh, your uh, your labor mix. <laughs> what are you gonna put what, on? Uh, what what song would you listen to whilst in labor? Ooh, let's see. Well, it's it's tough due to the fact that I won't ever be. It's hard okay. to put myself in the frame of reference. But sure. what I would want, like, would you want something? Would you want a pump up? Do you think, or do you think you'd want something calm? Yeah, I'm assuming you want a jam, right? I mean, that's, that's the perfect time for it. You're really going to get into the music. You're really going to, like, appreciate those beats. You yeah. won't be distracted at all, I can't imagine. Yeah, what do, you, what do you got? You got one? Yeah, I do, actually. But it's, it's the perfect answer, but unfortunately, it's not from an like, extremely popular band or an extremely popular song. So it's, it's one of those things that's like, it would be a perfect answer if the band was more popular. And I yeah. could just point at it and everyone would go, haha, yeah, of course, that's a great answer. Uh, it's literally made by Ballpark Music. Mm. The, the people the who you actually, like, put on before your stream. Sorry? The people you put on before your stream. Usually, right? Yeah, exactly. Yeah. Ballpark Music, one of the bands I put on before my stream. They had an a album coming out in one month and a half. And I am extremely, extremely excited. Actually, Rhapsody, it's going to be about a month and a third by the time this comes out. Get your facts straight. Or month and month uh, and I <laughs> I apologize. Let me uh, let me get my facts as straight as possible. If you you're, you're when trying is Ballpark to... Music's next album coming out? Yeah, there we go. <laughs> uh, just we'll say the exact date so we can apparently use, so we can advertise. Apparently, Google doesn't know it, so they've just showed me a tweet from Ballpark Music that says, "Sick of dropping me damn phone on me damn face." <laughs> So it's coming out in sick of dropping me damn phone on me damn face. Okay. Do you have a pukey? I do. <laughs> Wait, I don't have a pukey. I don't have a pukey. Can okay. I have this pukey? I'll, I'll hold off. I'm going to get some tenderness. Okay. Let me find... Oh, God. Where did I put my sheet? I haven't caught a tem in so long. <laughs> uh, I'm not prepared for actually catching a tem. i got to draw a name real quick. Okay. Oh, okay, okay, okay. I don't think I have anybody named this. Ooh, what's the name? Justice Tom. Ah, Justice Tom. Demon Crawl Master Extraordinaire. Mm-hmm. Ooh, that's got to be a passage that gets opened at some point, right? That's like a, a Reggie Rock kind <clears throat> of building right there. Yeah, we have to run, run into it as hard as possible, I think. Yeah, this is totally the way to get to a new island. Or something in the future. Yep. Agreed. I'm gonna quickly uh, do some stuff with my squad though because yeah, I'm not gonna move. Yeah, it's it's a, it's a bad time to be me. Oh. Oops. Well done. Thank you. No problem. Hmm. Now I don't want to level D hex if D hex is gonna give me a new D hex. <laughs> I don't want to waste that's, my time. That's a fair point well made. I don't want to waste my time. So maybe that is a problem. Hmm. I just want Etheron to level up. So I can use his good stats. Yeah, everybody else has got pretty bad stats. Oh my god. Aounsu? How is Aounsu? Aounsu's stats are bad? <laughs> how is he so... <laughs> You're telling me... The, the damage that Aounsu is doing is from a bad Ganky? 
Mm-hmm. Oh my god. Imagine if you had a good one. How's your special attack though? 13. <laughs> That's what I'm saying. Okay, so it's specifically his most important stat that's Yeah, he, he's got great defense and special defense, but his special attack is very bad. Etheron's good across the board, except his HP is okay and his special defense is bad. So if he gets hit, if he gets one abracadabra in his face, he's, he's toast. Oh, do we have that? Do you have one of those things? Oh, I don't, uh, I don't I do have not. one. Oh, shoot. Heck. Man. Oh, well. Well, let's let's uh, get rid of the pukey first. Or not. That's fine, too. No! Oh, heck! <laughs> yeah, we'll get rid of the pukey first. We'll get rid of the pukey first. Oh! I'll crit you. I'm gonna crit you. No! <laughs> I was throwing it to the pukey. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, Mishy! Bad mistake right there, friend. You goofball. You absolute goofball. <laughs> <laughs> I weakened it, and now I capture it. Nice pukey. Thank you. Yeah, it's pie. Good, good defense and everything else is garbage. <laughs> Just right. I don't think the Omishi can do me. Ever want him to do you so much you could die? You ever wanted so much? <laughs> what? It, I I wish I could remember that whole thing off by heart, so I could just do it at a drop. Yeah. How many ten cards do you have? I have eighty nine, <laughs> because you've been using all yours. I have a feeling. I haven't thrown that many ten cards. I have a feeling I have more than you. Uh, I have a feeling you probably don't. All I need is like a turn where yours is dead and then I get the throw. Not gonna happen. Not gonna happen. Oh! Actually, it's actually not gonna happen because you've. Oh, come on! If I can't have it, no one can! How did I not catch it? <laughs> How did that not catch it? That's wild. Oh uh, my god. That's how I thought that was going to go down as well. I thought that uh, you might try and attack me also, but I might outspeed you and then kill it first. Jeez, <laughs> uh, I got Drill Impact, which is a 120 damage physical move, which apparently Aounsu is not... I don't know. Apparently Aounsu is good at more than special attacks, so I guess I'll try. Guess I'll yeah, try. Seems like a decent idea. Man, I would love one of those uh, those Thames. I could go for one of them Thames right about now. Mm -hmm. I mean, we're going to be surfing around for a little bit. We'll probably get another one. I had to do it. <laughs> <laughs> had to is a strong, accurate word. <laughs> Wee. Come on. They might be Wee. really frequent. Nope. Ooh. Do you have a closet? I think I have a closet. But I think mine's garbage. No, I don't have a Colossu. Oh. All yours. Unless... Is it just me or do these Colossus look smaller than usual? Uh, are you thinking of the Evolve form? I am. Thank you. <laughs> you <laughs> sold it for me. Is it just me or is the Evolve form of Colossu just a bigger Colossu? <laughs> uh, no, he kind of looks more like an anchor. All right. Well, I'm wrong on all fronts, apparently. Is it just me, or is the uh, evolved form of Kalazu wildly different than the base form of Kalazu? No. You know, now that you mention it, yeah, it actually really is. <laughs> it's a good point well made. They, they're seven close. Seven HP, seven stamina. Wow. Oof. Ooh. Ooh. 
Okay, so it got overexerted, so it has to rest for a turn. I'm gonna wind burst it and then I'm gonna try and catch it. Or you can oh, catch shoot. it. I don't need it. Oh, it's dead. Yeah. Nope. All no! yours. All yours. This is D Hex, so <laughs> I will just assume ah, right. I will just assume that I don't have to catch one. <laughs> That's nuts. That good, I have huh? to make those noises in order to assess the stats, you know? It's actually, if you if you put it out on a piece of paper, it, it graphs out the stats good to bad. It does. Thank you. It's, it's like, uh, you know how there used to be, it used to be, uh, you know how there was discovered, uh, like a hacker discovered how to make free phone calls by whistling a certain tune into a phone? Excuse me, what? <laughs> yeah, a hacker figured out how to make free phone calls by whistling a certain tune into Phone? I don't know, like back in the uh, 20s, 60s, I don't know. Like, all the time before I was born is vaguely just old. It's before. Exactly. This is a, uh, it's it's a uh, BR. I'm not talking Battle Royale. Before Rhapsody. Before Rhapsody. Uh, I need to swap. Both of those are electrical and uh, I got a brain that's gonna just like, bzz. Under pressure, the it's... first time that I actually managed to do the pop with the finger in the mouth thing was right then. <laughs> Chain lightning. Ah, right, cool. All right. Do you have Good something work, that's Chris. not not weak to Zach? I do not. Okay. Good question though. <laughs> oh heck. <laughs> you, you know, like when I, whenever you in Pokemon, you're like, why do all the gym leaders have Pokemon that are weak to the same type? I feel like I understand it now. <laughs> They're all just you. <laughs> I swear these enemies are doing what we did right back at us, and it's rude. How dare they? Yeah. I don't like it when it's us. Oh, okay. I'm not sending out my last one just to get it, you know, murked. It's true. You don't want it. You don't want to get murked. Exactly. I've been very clear about my anti murking stance. Oh. Oh, Genki, you fool! That's a really cool looking move. I think that one deserves a rag <sighs> some ragdoll physics too, to be honest. It definitely, definitely do. That was dope as heck, my guy. It just uses, oh, it just uses a lot of energy, that's why. I forgot about that aspect of Temtem because it hasn't been relevant until right now, and it's still not relevant, actually. Because they died. Good lord. Hey, Valkyrie got a level! Everything's alright with the world. Foil the game! That's no, all shall, shall prevail. Prevail. Uh, prevail. 180 is 189 dollars. They just vanished. Did you see that? They actually pooped. Yeah. I guess it's just so that... Uh, oh, this is uh, part of the quest. Messen's vial is empty. Yeah, see? it's probably part of the quest. Anyway. Are we... That's the kind of question we should probably finish in the next episode. Until then, my name is Vin Rousey. His name's been Read of Retromation. There's a playlist in the down below with all of our contents of the game. Hot, as well as the channel you're not currently watching on. Hopefully you've been enjoying yourselves. And hope... See you next time. Bye.